Okay. Do this simultaneous reaction problem. What I would do is find what I have and see where it's down here. So I'll circle, I have a B. I want B, and it's right there. I don't see it anywhere else. Tell me if you see it though. I have H2, I need that in my answer. And it's here, and I think that's the only place. I need B2H6, so I'll make this a, a squiggly cloud, okay? Or a sheep, depending on your preference. So, well, where the heck is it? Oh, okay. here, in two. If you had different color pens, that would be a convenient place to use it right now. Okay, I think all those uh, are pretty much set. Everything else uh, is going to be what? Yeah, everything else is called intermediate. So there's lots of intermediates. Uh, looks like there's O2, there's H2O, two forms of gas and liquid, and there's B2O3. Oh, and then I didn't put the state of this, this one. This is gas. All right. So how do you do this? Well, I usually start with overall reaction and then move to the intermediates next. So uh, I know I want one B in my answer. Uh, in order to get that, and I have two Bs here. So I'm going to multiply this by one half to make it one. So the first reaction, I multiply by one half. That'll give me one B when I add them all up. Uh, for the H2, I need three halves H2, and I only have one down here. So I'm going to multiply the third reaction by three halves. And then the, uh, now let's look at the last one, the B2H6. I need one half in the products. But notice down here I only have, I have one, and it's in the reactants. So to fix that, I'm going to multiply the second reaction by minus one half. The minus flips it to the products, and the one half allows me to have one half. Now notice I have the first three reactions have a parentheses and a multiplier. Those three are locked down, meaning you can't change them now. Once they have a multiplier, you don't change them anymore. They're done. So really, the only the last reaction left is the fourth reaction. So. Uh, these, this fourth reaction only has intermediates, so I need to make both of these cancel out. Well, let's see where else they appear. Liquid water, this one, appears right here. And there's three halves here in the products. So if I multiply this by three halves, this reactant will cancel. And if you're nervous, which you should be on an exam, uh, you should see if the other ones cancel. So for example, water gas state, there's three halves in the products. And up here, there's minus three halves in the product. So that'll cancel. So you'll see everything's going to cancel. And there's my multipliers. <coughs> one half, minus one half, three halves, three halves. And we're done. Any questions on this one?